It's the news families affected by this fire have been waiting for. People who live in the Deer Creek Mesa and Cooster neighborhoods can finally return home tonight and sleep in their own beds. But it's only if they have a particular badge with them to get that access back to their homes. Now that leaves four neighborhoods still in mandatory evacuation status awaiting their turn. Before we sat down at the five o'clock briefing, I said, Linda, look at the email. We're going home after leaving their home in the foothills, not knowing if it would still be standing when they came back. Donald and Linda Murray are elated. They're some of the first Cory fire evacuees heading home. And we said it's going to be a margarita night. <laughs> Donald is showing us the light blue badge he picked up at Dakota Ridge High School's evacuation center. The Jefferson County Sheriff's Office says these are necessary to get back into the Deer Creek Mesa and Cooster neighborhoods, which have both been downgraded to pre-evacuation status as of Saturday evening. I wish everybody was going home. Officials say that decision was made because of a strong fire line and Cooster's distance from the fire. I want to also say you're going to see some smoke and you're going to see a lot of smoke tomorrow. Though the fight is not finished yet. We feel confident of, of the move we're making. We don't think it'll come to that, but don't wash your hands and say we're done. Containment is now up to 20% with 472 acres burned. The sheriff's office says all resources are being poured into the arson investigation that's underway while the community eagerly awaits answers. If it was deliberate, um, I would certainly be very disappointed with something like that. Some are breathing a sigh of relief to finally go back home. You're watching flames a quarter mile away from your house and you're thinking, I hope these guys are professionals and they certainly were. Throughout this entire firefight, the sheriff's office says no homes have lost power or water. Now, if you are returning home, they also say you should expect to see firefighters and crews making way through your neighborhood, just checking on the status of the quarry fire in the coming weeks. I'm live in Jefferson County tonight. Claire Lavazorio, Denver 7.